Students never cease to amaze when it comes to what they do with their passions. A recent example being Hannah Edwards, who was working alongside Dr. Allwine, a tenured professor here at the Classics Department, as they open up an official documented museum here at Randolph Hall. Edwards was awarded the Mays Grant of $1,000 through the Urca Foundation in order to complete the Classics Museum of the College of Charleston. The museum will hold over 100 artifact replicas from Greece, like frescoes, statues, and pottery, all of which were brought over from Dr. Frank Morris, a retired professor. So what I've been working on is compiling a list of name, dates, and locations that the replicas represent real artifacts that are in Greece. This project is significant due to the fact this is what the college's original education was taught on. I definitely think it's important to not only the classic students who study um, Greek and Roman history, but it's definitely it's part of the college's history. Um, we were a school that originally had the AB degree and we were founded in 1770 and the basis of our school was Greek and Roman history, philology, and um, the study of those cultures. Edwards hopes to hold a gala towards the end of March as they celebrate this milestone of the Classics Department as they open up the Classics Museum of the College of Charleston. Anyone is welcome to come to see the museum during normal business hours being 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. This is Riley Clark with Cistern Yard.